there we have our lines A, B and C, D parallel in our auxiliary elevation here. The question asks us to find the shortest distance between the two skew lines. To do this, we're going to have to look perpendicular to these two lines and find where these two lines intersect. That will be the shortest distance in between these two skew lines. So the first step is bring all points A, B, C and D perpendicular to the lines A, B and C, D. All these lines are perpendicular. Add in your X2, Y2 line and get your heights. So this one you're working on 1, 2 from the XY line to 2. So B goes out to here and D from the XY line to D XY line to D. Find A, B, C, D and find where they intersect. As you can see these two lines intersect here. So we're going to bring this point back up to our auxiliary elevation and you see that it hits the A B line here and hits the C D line here so that's the shortest distance in our auxiliary elevation. To find it in our plan we bring this point and this point parallel to our other lines so perpendicular to our X Y line and we find the shortest distance in plan and to find an elevation we bring the points up from here and here to find their elevation and that's the shortest distance in our elevation and plan. To find the shortest horizontal distance this is a wee bit different. The initial steps are the exact same so we just find your two lines that are parallel but the horizontal, what does horizontal mean? Horizontal means level across. So in this scenario, level across is parallel to our x1, y1 line. So we're going to bring all our points A, B, C, D like we did a second ago parallel to our x1, y1 line. Parallel to x1, y1. Throw in our x2, y2 line here. And we're going to find A, B, C and D. So like previous, this is the one we're working on. This is back 1. This is back 2. X, Y line to 2. So B is this distance. So step it up. And A is this distance. So from here, step it up. And then join them together. There's your two skew lines. A, B and C, D. And where these two lines intersect, here is the shortest horizontal distance between the two lines. So drop this point back down to auxiliary elevation and it crosses here and here. There's your shortest distance in your auxiliary elevation. Bring it back to your plan. Find the shortest distance in your plan and bring it up to your elevation and you'll find that these two lines must be level across because it's a horizontal distance. It's quite hard to see there but if they're spread out they would be straight across. That's how you find the shortest horizontal distance and the shortest distance between two skew lines.